Many people are currently facing certificates of sponsorship delays and as a result, haven't been able to apply for their UK visa because it's a requirement. Those affected the most are those who applied between November 2023 till now April 2024. A good number of people applied in December. But till now, most of them have submitted further information requested by the UK Home Office but have not yet received a decision on their certificates of sponsorships. So what could be going on? We understand this situation can be very frustrating, especially for those who applied earlier enough but are still waiting. But don't worry. In today's video, we will try to explain to you the reasons for all the delays and give advice to you on what we think you can do to speed up your decision process. Who knows, maybe you will be lucky if you follow it, and you may get yours after you apply what we will tell you. But before we get there, please, if you've not already, subscribe to our channel to continue receiving updates from us. Without any further delays, let's begin. Those who applied for certificates of sponsorship between November 2024 till now October 2024 are facing delays because of the following reasons. In the first place, a damning inspection report found multiple failures in the Home Office's system for awarding 275 certificates of sponsorship granted to a care home without its knowledge and using false information. This means that recently the Home Office discovered that most care homes were being granted certificates of sponsorship when the care homes were all fake. So this made the Home Office understand that many care homes are frauds and do not deserve to issue certificates of sponsorships. But so it's possible that this issue made the Home Office halt most certificates of sponsorships to adequately verify care homes properly before beginning the issue again. Since then, they've been a massive slowdown in certificates of sponsorship issuance and most companies registered under the Care Quality Commission are not getting theirs which they applied already. It's possible the Home Office trusts no one again until it finishes the verification of regulated companies before certificates of sponsorships will be approved. This mostly affects those applying for the care worker visa. Secondly, we all have seen how the UK government has published many new rules including regulations for certificates of sponsorships. The new rules also include new requirements for sponsors under the skilled workers visa, new requirements for sponsors under the health and care visa, family visas, and many other visas. So it's possible that the UK before the Home Office approves any sponsorship, they have to recheck again to make sure they are approving on the basis of the new rules. If not, they will keep asking you to provide further information and if the information you provided is not enough, you will be rejected. So this is another big reason why the UK Home Office may be delaying your certificate of sponsorship and you've not gotten it till now. Thirdly, since the UK government is bent on discouraging foreign employment, encouraging home-based employment and also reducing legal migration, cut they may deliberately not give decisions on a large number of certificates of sponsorship such that they can only approve it after all the new rules that were to take effect on 11th April had taken effect. So those coming then to the UK will only fall under the new rules because the new rules mostly affect only those who get their visas after April 11th. They know that if they do this, they've successfully stopped a great number of people from bringing dependents to the UK in care visas, skilled workers, study etc. etc and as such, the rules are implemented. Another reason could also be that the Home Office might have dedicated a team to make sure they check the profiles of those parent companies that are applying for certificates of sponsorship on their behalfs to make sure they meet the qualification. Those are some of the reasons why your certificate of sponsorship may be denied lately for those who've already applied. But despite all these delays, some people are still getting approved because the UK Home Office hasn't published any document that shows that they're not issuing COS. So some people are still receiving fears why others are being slowed down. Our advice is that, if you are being faced with this issue, don't panic, okay? Beckways, we believe the Home Office will begin giving decisions very soon, especially as the new rules have been implemented already. What you should do is to keep in touch with your company to find out the progress of your costs so that they can mount pressure on you KV to provide you with a decision faster. We also recommend you, you use an immigration lawyer to follow up your case with the Home Office with that, you can easily get your decision faster. So for those of you facing this issue, relax and don't panic. 
Once your company is registered with the Care Qualify Commission CQC, you will obviously get your decision soon. We hope this information was very helpful to you and it answered most of your doubts about certificates of sponsorships. If you have any concerns, leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more on UK visa and immigration updates. Have a great day.